Hello and welcome back to Fallout New Vegas with your story loads in the demand. Now we almost walked right pa past this duffel bag with the box just because we were already at this location when we started that location. I should not have stood up. It's the first lesson of not being seen. Don't stand up. I hope his little buddy there doesn't mind. Call him Beast, apparently. What do we have? Yeah, this looks like a toy. <laughs> Does it tickle, buddy? Does it? Does it tickle? Does it tickle? It's a Tesla cannon. There's a cannon. There's a cannon. Na, 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 na. In the divide. This is this will be the new show. There's a cannon in the divide. There's a cannon. There's a cannon. I wonder if we can just keep using this Tesla cannon for now then. Just for the joy of the Tesla cannon. There's a cannon. Ooh. Nice. Those are actually a fair bit more expensive. Hmm. I don't know. Guess not. Alright, uh, what else do we have? There's a hole there. Not that important to us. What is important is that there's a cannon. There's a cannon. No, 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 it's kinda noisy. There's a cannon. <laughs> there's a cannon. <laughs> I'm sorry. I, I can't. It's the there's a cannon. It's supposed to be a song. Every shot it takes. Every move it makes. It's meant to be a song. Of course it's very little damage here. That's a flare. Where's the bugger? Oh, so the other one died. So now we have this guy. How am I gonna get to that corpse? Wait, I have a plan. Maybe this will help. Eee. Show me the goods. Drop the corpse down. Wait, no, apparently that did absolutely nothing. Well, at least we have this a cannon. There's a cannon. There's a cannon. I am almost sorry about what I'm doing here, but I'm not really. Can I? No. I don't have anything to mod it either. And the arc welder, the arc welder cannot be used to repair it, sadly. But do you have some additional? Re Wait, you can repair stuff, can't you? Yeah, you can repair it. Apparently. Like once per day. That was nice. I think I got the hurt real bad. Let's just use up the doctor back because I'm running low. No, I'm not running low on them, I'm running low on space to carry them. Because apparently I have managed to gather up a lot. Satchel charges. Oh my. That sounds like something that will have an explosive result. And no one is surprised. Because neither they are explosives. Alright, what do we have here? Is there a way up from this side? Or is there a way up from the other side? Because it looks like there's stuff there. Or if not stuff, there looks to be an opportunity for stuff. Mm, no, I don't think we can get up there. Which is a damn shame, really. Alright, I see enemy markers, so... Oh, hello. This a friendly little deathclaw. 
He's so far away, I didn't even get to see the health marker. Guess we did that then. Did all of those shots miss or something? Hey, you got the ED, that's rude. Did he kill me? Alright, fine. For some reason I expected them to be slightly less useful. Might be a matter of me not using heavy or medium armor this time there. There we go, that's more like it, right? Yeah. That means I don't dead. And not deading is the first step towards victory. Oh really it is. Honest. Have you not did it today? Good for you. Because that's the first step towards victory. I think I just heard some noises. But I'm not sure. And that appears to be a death claw. Just outside our little hut here. A real death claw. I have no idea where it came from and I don't really care for him. Not a lot anyway. Here I was just looting some delicious delicious ammo. While fighting some hungry hungry hippos. Wait no. That's not what happened. There was not a single hippo in sight. Can I take this out from this range? Apparently so. Well, apparently the death code is mine at all, though. At all. It's just stood there. Like a silly. Like a nicely big silly. Alright, what else do we have here? Some motorcycle pieces, that's nice. That's very nice. Ah, okay, now where are you, you bugger? I see your marker. I don't see you. I want to see you too, so I can kill you where your marker is. We're in caution, because someone just spawned right in next to us. Now, this isn't looking good. This is not looking good at all. Unless... Nope, nope, that didn't hit. Yep, there we go. Dead again. Some people would start considering the usage of heavier armor in these situations. Not me, though. I'll start considering using more ammunition. Really is unconscious, so don't mind. Maybe if I heal before we encounter the situation. Like I have these stim packs, you know. I could use them to heal up to 500 apparently. That's a lot of health. Alright, I see you. Show me your face. Thanks. A few more shots, please. Two. Oh. Shoot number three was apparently not required. Shoot, not shot. Shoot number three. Ah, shoot. I will never learn how to speak proper English. Never. Alright, well, we still have a enemy marker, so that's something to be worried about. Because odds are, it's a fucking death claw. And somehow, the death claws here are actually competent at killing my silly ass. How silly, isn't it? That's silly. Really silly. Ah, there's a survivor's footlocker here. Who the survivor is, we don't know. 
And we also don't know why he named his Foot Locker. Like, where did we read the name of the Foot Locker? How did we identify it as a survivor's Foot Locker? Maybe the survivor's Foot Locker already belongs to the dead man. It's possible, you know? Hmm. Once again, I don't see shit. Oh, yeah, let's not walk off that. I wonder if there will be warheads, like, in the distance. In all, all due respect, sir, I think you're making a mistake. We're close to a breakthrough with the Duraframe iBots. I can feel it. Yes, sir. Yes, sir, I understand that we need the Duraframe assets for Hellfire armor, but... No, sir. Yes, sir. I understand, sir. I'll tell the team to start disassembling the ED series prototypes right away. Eddie, you little rascal, were you eavesdropping again? I think those videos you watch are a bad influence on you. How much of that did you hear? Hmm. Didn't Dr. Grant say she'd upgraded your navigational systems? And I think I have an idea. How'd you like to be just like Ralphie? Do you record everything that's said around you? <laughs> uh, sounds like Dr. Whitney was a bit of a rogue element. Yes, I'm beginning to see, see where you get it from. Huh. I think I would have liked him. Okay, let's get going. To be fair... The Hellfire armor was pretty good. But not good enough for me not to have had an ED companion in Fallout 3. Come on, Eddie even. Well, my Eddies are called Eddies. But the model name is Eddie. Wait, actually the ED series was... Never mind. That's a big ass death claw. I'm gonna think that the correct reaction here is to there's a cannon. There's a cannon, there's a cannon. I think that might have also killed Didi. Well, knocked him unconscious anyway. There's a cannon, there's a cannon. I really need to learn how to use this properly. Look at all the ammo though. But to be fair, it uses like. Uh, how much does it use per shot? Did it go three shots per reload or was it four? Oh, we'll find out in a bit, won't we? Alright, well, we currently don't have enemy markers, but that doesn't mean I trust there not to be enemies. I think that's a warhead. Alright, this looks like a collapsed tunnel. And we're getting lots of XP for I don't know what. I think we are only one level away from level 50 now. So yeah, that, that'll mean we'll stop leveling up. What a shame. I think this is probably one of Ulysses' vlogs again. Yep. Give it a good listen then. I walked the Great Salt Lake as Kaiser's eye, then his hand. Mongrels there, two legs and four. Saw the walls of New Canaan and the scavengers circled, and the strength or fire to take. Too high, too strong. White legs. They were born for war. They run to it, hungry for battle. Yet their hunger is to be a part of history, something larger. Like the Legion, as always, brought them a message from Kaisar. If New Canaan burns, Kaiser might see them. Might. Even the chance was a lie. To honor Kaiser, destroy the history of New Canaan and the way they carry it in their generations and family. Kaiser respects such strength, I told them. That, that was truth. Even if strength wasn't the word. Obedience. You must be willing to kill anyone. Children, mothers, the weak, elders. If these new Canaanites value the generations 
That is what you must kill. It was like Wolpus was speaking through me. Use the night, silence, and fire to change their words to pleas, to screams. No need for bombs when hate will do. I ask the White Legs to destroy a people with ancestry going back thousands of years. Another death of history lost to time. The new Canaanites. They supplied medicine, food traded with others, civilization, a hand from the past, not history. But maybe a past deeper. Farther than that to a place where this God really exists. If so, his handiwork and people belong elsewhere. Not in this place. Oh fuck. Another symbol like bear and bull with no meaning in the present. Looks like it's a six shot thing. Do the saw one more. Yeah, he's behind this corner now. Run away, run away, run away. Fire! The cannon! Ooh, it actually took a limb off. Nice. Bloody donators. Always interrupting my good, good, silent business. Are those enemies upstairs? And they might be back on the bridge. But I'm not entirely certain why we came down here. I thought the way forward was actually to the... I actually know very well why we came down here. They might be nukes. And if there might be nukes... Is all we need to know. Of course, could be far. Oh, so many large rifle boxes! Wow! Holy fucking shit! Can we even make this many? No, I'm out of cases. That's, that's right, right? No, I'm out of rifle powder. Well, in that case, we may actually be able to... Wait, that's a... That's rifle powder. That's a lot of rifle powder. And then we may also break down... Do we have any more of that? No, we probably cannot break down the extra ones, like the special ones. More rifle powder? Nice. I'll just take all of that stuff. It's good stuff. Okay, what am I looking for 308 now? A large rifle uh, primus, yeah. Okay. That's the usual issue, really. That's what we most commonly run out of. To be fair though, now I'm using a weapon for which I have over 3000 ammo. Though it does use 5 ammo per shot, but you know. Still, we have loads of ammo. Lots of tosh. Lots of money. Because there doesn't appear to be an additional nuke here. I'll switch to a more silent weapon again because, god damn, the desert cannon is really noisy against our ears. Yes. Alright, uh, now. Let's just head back up there and hope for the best, which in this case should be a severe lack of death claws. Yeah. Yeah. Also, there's something on the bridge. Now we know there's something on the bridge, and it is this one, Deathclaw, maybe two. 
It's two death claws. I think we only taunted one at a time there. Which is good news. Because otherwise we could have gotten into serious trouble. Uh, there's no way for me to hit his head, is there? It has a 3% chance. Alright. Yeah, that's a better chance. The scope is way out of position. Didn't quite realize that before. Okay, these are dead death claws. Good. I think the way to go is up there. And I have no idea where this additional death claws came from because we had cleared out the entire turf. No? Thought we had. We're doing quite well there. Quite well indeed. Alright, we blew up three nukes in the area? I need to remember that so I can check if there's supposed to be more. And if it simply missed them all. Because I don't want to miss a thing. You know? I was about to read what sort of an explosive that is. But that's his actual charge. Alright, cool. That does explain the entire situation there. Nice. Alright. What we've, got, what we've got now is more such charges, so... We need to keep an, out, keep an eye out open for them, because those are... Effective. Yes. God fucking damn it. God fucking damn it. Yeah, I can see this one at least. I wonder if this car would have done a nuclear explosion next to it if it, that had blown up. I would have hoped so. Alright, let's check out this little house here. It just looks like a sort of situation that's worth getting into. Huh. So apparently there's been a fight! With no survivors. Not even a true survivor. Alright, well, what do we have here? Well, I'll never find out if I just keep rotating around the place, will I? Yeah. Looks like there's goods. Uh, lots of such charges. Good to know, good to know. It's not like we don't want to explode ourselves. My son has already looted that guy. I'll take your hollow points, though they are still problematic because I'm not sure I can get my thingies from there. Oh! Where did you come from? I suppose you must have been the last survivor. Whoop. What are you doing, Ponsa? Hmm? Oh, hi. Where are those buggers? Well, there's one. And there's two. These are three mods. I should have not taken those, maybe. This will do. Maybe not quite as effective as I hoped. Alright, oh, this again and deals damage over time as well, alright? Come on! Let me just hit your fucking face. It's really good time. There's a cannon, there's a cannon. It's what they use for taking care of some situations. 
in which you don't feel like using this particular weapon. Okay, bones, so what do we even have? More really expensive money. Yeah, I like that money. That's some good money. I uh, know I don't need the military organs. Thank you for offering the... Yeah, I, I prefer this spoil cap here. Thanks. Can't craft anything because I don't have anything. Great. Though I am generating some survival skills, so, you know, I should be able to get this stuff soon. An extra sniper rifle. Thank you very much. That means I can repair my shed. You know, taking that he actually had a sniper rifle, I would have expected him not to try to kill me at such short range. Like, why did he run closer to me? Why? Uh, anyway, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. I'm quite sure I did not intend to do that one.